Welcome back. In this video, we shall talk about the Scrimba Playground Editor and how we shall be using it throughout this course. Scrimba is a platform for easy learning. On Scrimba, there are lots of courses majorly covering JavaScript and front-end development. We shall be using the Scrimba Editor in learning JavaScript because it provides us a console which is going to log all our results instead of using VS Code that is going to require us going back and forth the browser's console. Also note that everything we do using Scrimba will work just fine on any editor, be it VS Code, Sublime, Atom or anyone. When you write your JavaScript code in any of these editors, run it in your browser like a HTML file, then go over to the console deck to view your results. This means you can also learn along without using Scrimba. You can use VS Code or any editor you have, but you only have to go through the stress of logging your results on the console and, and having to go to VS Code, having to go back to your browser, having to go to the console deck and coming back. The back and forth is all we are trying to avoid and that's why we are using Scrimba. Nothing more than that. So let's look at how Scrimba works and how you can set up Scrimba for learning JavaScript. You need to have an account. If you don't have an account with Scrimba, you come over here, you create an account. Don't have an account yet, sign up. So I'm going to log in with my GitHub account. So after creating an account, you need to log in and follow the steps. Come over here to the top right corner, click on this plus sign and click on this arrow to select JavaScript. And this is JavaScript. Click on it. Select Playground and click on Confirm. And this is it. We now have our environment for learning JavaScript in an easy way. This is our editor and this is our console. So you can see Hello from JavaScript is logged to the console here using console.log and we have hello from JavaScript here. We don't have to go back and forth the editor and the browser and the console deck in the browser. We don't need to do all of that. And this is our HTML file also. As you can see, the script file is linked in our HTML file in the head tag. So this is all you need to do to get ready to follow along practically throughout this course. Thank you very much. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to share.